To achieve a decline in maternal and child mortality and death from vaccine preventable diseases, expanding the network of community health workers in Nigeria becomes very crucial. This is what the United Nations International Children's Emergency Fund, UNICEF, is aggressively working on alongside international and local partners to help boost the quality of life of Nigerians. In a chat with our health correspondent, UNICEF's Chief of Health, Nigeria, Dr. Eduardo Celades, highlights at different programs of UNICEF Nigeria and the potential for improving maternal and child health in the country. The challenges in Nigeria's healthcare sector have affected the health status of its population, leaving many prone to diseases, infection, and prolonged disorder. UNICEF has been engaging in different programs in every state of the Federation to help improve the health of the vulnerable, from training public health workers, to improving access to quality medicines, vaccines, medical facilities, and reproductive health materials. But the weak health system and inequity remains the challenge. Expand the network of community health workers. Community health workers like CHIPS, the community health influencers and promoters, are the first line where people in the, in the rural areas are looking for care, right? If your child has fever yeah. or cough or diarrhea, you're going to your community health worker. We don't have enough in, at this moment. There are less than 20,000 CHIPS in the whole Nigeria. So the government has a very ambitious plan to reach up to 40,000 additional community health workers in the next two years. But what, the, what we believe like women and children need is pr a, a functional one-stop 24-7 primary health care unit in at least every ward of the country. There are more than 2 million children in Nigeria who have not received any vaccines at all, contributing to child mortality rate. You may recall that over 100 were killed following the diphtheria outbreak, a vaccine-preventable disease. This is just one of many, showing the need for aggressive child vaccination. Also, 80,000 women die every year to maternal mortality, over 200 every day. These statistics reveal the many hurdles to scale. We as UNICEF, we are committed to work with government and partners to really work around this issue. We need to, for us, this is like an emergency. But as well, we're working at community level to have more community work, timely referral, time, timely identification of risks, etc. To strengthen the system, to have more uh, antenatal checkups. We have some priority states, and there are 14 priorities in the, in, in the country based on the EPI data. To us, if we are able to have a strong primary healthcare system, with human resources, midwives, resources, financing, commodities, good infrastructure, solar panels, and water in the health facilities. That will make the difference. However, equitable primary health care centers is the only way to respond to the needs of the people. UNICEF says it is out to support any state ready to upgrade its PSCs. Modupo Lua Shere Mekun Ogunjobi, Silverbird News 24, Lagos.